Hello, everyone. This is Eric Bobro with my special guest, architect and instructor Andreas Lettner from Innsbruck, Austria. We're going to be talking about the Sinner Render Methods, Tips, and Tricks course that Andreas will be teaching as part of the Masters of Archicad training series. How are you doing, Andreas? Not too bad, Eric. And you? Good, good. Uh, so I know you've been um, an Archicad user for a long time. Tell us a little bit about your background as an architect and an Archicad user. Oh, yes, a very long time. <laughs> I started to use Archicad in uh, 1991, uh, around the time when I graduated from the University of Innsbruck. And I'm uh, nowadays partner in a small practice in Innsbruck uh, focused on residential buildings. And beside that, I'm an uh, instructor for Archicad here in Tyrol and forever. Okay. Well, uh, uh, I know you've been using CineRender and Cine, well, the Cinema 4D for a long time and that uh, you uh, were excited when Graphisoft introduced it into Archicad. Tell us a little bit about that story. Yes, that's true. Uh, the first time I got contact uh, with uh, Cinema 4D, as I remember, was in 1996. We had to make a job with very complex shapes and at that time Archicad couldn't do that. Uh, so we had to look for an alternative. Uh, and Cinema 4D at that time was a market leading tool for animations, uh, modeling and uh, of course visualizations with renderings. Uh, so, so when Graphisoft introduced the Cine Render, this, the rendering technology into Archicad, what made you, you know, so excited? I know it, it made a big difference in your workflow. Of course, uh, course uh, since Cine Render Engine is integrated into Archicad, uh, uh, you can set up uh, your specific workflow within your practice and you don't have to leave Archicad. Okay. Now, um, when I've been working with Archicad users uh, this past year, I've seen many of them uh, a little bit frustrated because they're not getting the results from Cine Render that they could. And uh, Graphisoft has built it up as this amazing uh, solution. And yet, for some reason, many users are not getting what, what they could out of it. What do you see are the main frustrations and the opportunities that they're missing in Cine Render? Hmm. It's obvious uh, because as Cine Render Engine is a high professional render engine, it has got all those options you have to control. And uh, to know that is, to be honest, not the job of an architect which should focus on these projects and not on being a rendering technologist. <coughs> So uh, do you see Archicad users getting uh, the highest quality or let's say very nice quality images uh, from Cine Render? Because that's something that I see many of them say, you know, it doesn't look as different as I thought. Yes, of course. Uh, there are two points, I would say. Uh, the first one is the quality of the images. As you mentioned, uh, most of the time users expect a, a, a natural look which they do not achieve with the standard settings. Uh, and the uh, second uh, point is the render time. Because if you are not uh, comfortable with these settings or the key settings, I would say, uh, the render time can increase dramatically. So you can spend a lot of time spinning your wheels and not get something that's really very satisfying. So when people go through this course that you'll be teaching, uh, what can they expect? What can Archicad users be able to do at the end of the four-week series? What they are able to do is uh, to get uh, very natural looking renderings uh, on a very, very short time. Uh, and they will be able to integrate their own settings seamlessly into their workflow. Okay, so they'll uh, have the confidence. I think all of you who are watching this, uh, you'll appreciate having the confidence that you can produce beautiful renderings in uh, a sort of a, a known amount of time. In other words, not have it balloon up, oh my God, this is taking an hour long and I, I have only half an hour to my meeting uh, sort of thing. And I think also um, having 
those beautiful images will help win some more business. I, I really do think that uh, clients and potential clients seeing the quality of the work that you do, uh, they'll have a different impression when you're able to achieve those results. So uh, Andreas, I'm looking forward to uh, working with you on this project. Uh, for all of you watching, you can join us. It will be starting uh, this coming Wednesday for a four-week series. There will be information about how to sign up on the page below this video. And if you watch this later on, you'll be able to uh, watch the recordings of the training series on the website as well. So Andreas, this is exciting. Look forward to working with you. It is an exciting project, and I'm happy to work with you, and I hope I see all of you on Wednesday. All right. Take care, everyone. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.